churches here. We pray for the pastor of this church and the other churches. We pray for Rick and his recovery. Uh, we, we have, uh, you know, first of all, we know that not all the prayers have been maybe uh, expressed, but you know what's going on in our heart. You know the people that are ill, Dr. Green's wife who's having an epidural, and uh, uh, all the people that, uh, you know, Helen Crone, and uh, we have so many people that are going through uh, physical and emotional things that we're asking for Camille, Pauline, some are asking uh, for Pauline to give her strength and peace of mind because of what Camille's going through and what he continues to go through. And Steve's mom, who's suffering from dementia, and we, we ask you to give Steve strength and the assurance that uh, his mother's going to be okay and he's going to be okay and, you know, everything that's necessary for him. We pray for the world situation. We pray there's a gentleman named Bill who was one of your servants and he was for many years helping with Camille's house and he's with you and and we pray for all his family and the people that knew him that are maybe uh, uh, saddened because of his uh, passing. Uh, Lord, we pray for our, our government, our president, our Congress. We pray for our, you know, our particular government here in the United States that we should all come together and be united. And united unto you, Jesus, we pray for salvation. We say pray for the children who don't have fathers or children that have fathers and maybe they're have problems of being abused and things like that. We pray for all those children. We pray that the children all find Jesus because you are the real, you are our Father. You are the Father. The, you, there is, we pray that they find the Father uh, and so that they link up with you and they can somehow look, look past any defects of their own Father. Uh, Lord, we thank you so much again for allowing us to have Pastor Carrie to pray for the message today that we all hear something in the message that brings us closer to you, Jesus, and that we're able to, as we leave from here, and, and maybe come, come in contact with other people, that we can be a great representative of individuals.